Welcome to my chef and my name is Chef Fran. This is my sous chef Ian. Hi, how are we doing today? And today we're going to give you a salmon salad. Mm. Salmon, your omega-3 fatty acid. A very good healthy fish for you to eat. So if you're not a person that likes fish, you can use chicken and call it your chicken salad. But we like salmon. Yes, we do. So we're offering you a salmon salad today. And we have all of our vegetables here cut up already. Um, we have our romaine lettuce here mixed with a little red um, radical. And we have our red onions already cut up and our bell peppers tricolor. Again, if you're used to watching our channel, you know that I love color because color represents nutrition and is aesthetically pleasing to the eyes. So I just love to try to incorporate colors however I can. So we have our tricolor bell peppers with the orange, the red, and the yellow. And um, we have our cool cucumber. Cool cucumber. You like that? Like that cool mm. cucumber. Because it is cool. Yes, it is. Um, and we have our cherry tomatoes and the beautiful red colors of the red and the yellow and the orange. And it looks like brownish purple, so to speak. Um, or if you only have red cherry tomatoes at home, you can use that as well. I want you guys to be creative and use what you like, use what you have at home. Or if you want to stop by the store and get these as well, that's fine too. And we have salmon and we cook salmon actually, we, what we did was cut it into chunks and we also just kind of just shredded it here. So that's going to go and this is going to be kind of like our garnish. The ones that's into chunks and the ones that is more shredded is going to go just inside with all of our veggies here. And we also have some plantain croutons. Um, yes, plantain. If you are plantain lovers, you're going to love plantain croutons. The only place that actually sells them is Trader Joe's. So, not sponsored, but I'm letting you know where you can get it. Mm -hmm. And we have some shaved Parmesan. And we have to make our vinaigrette, our vinaigrette dressing. We have some white wine and some olive oil and some dill and lemon. And, of course, our seasoning that we use is bell pepper and Himalayan salt. We love Himalayan salt here because we mm -hmm. love the pink. And we also love it because it's obviously low in sodium. So I'm going to get into the vitamin content. And then Ian is going to mix all of this together. We have a wonderful avocado. Oh, we can't yes, forget true. our healthy fat of avocado as well. And when I do the avocado, I'm actually going to tell you a little secret. Um, so we're going to get into our vitamin content. And then Ian's going to mix everything all together. And we're going to snack and eat. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. Okay. Okay, so we have our salmon here. And our salmon has our B6, B12, vitamin D, omega-3 fatty acids. We also have our cherry tomatoes, which has folate, vitamin C, and potassium. We have our cucumbers, which has vitamin B, C, and K. And we have our tricolor, bell peppers which has vitamin a c b2 and our beautiful red onions has vitamin b6 c potassium and folate and we have our wonderful romaine lettuce which has vitamin a k and calcium and we can't forget our avocado our avocado has vitamin c e and b6 and is your healthy fat and we have our shaved Parmesan here, which has your vitamin A, B6, B12, and it's a good source of protein. And, ha, huh, our crunchy, because you know, it's great when you eat to have different various textures. And plantain croutons has vitamin B6, magnesium, folate, and potassium. And plantains are a cousin of bananas. So let's get to making our dressing and mixing our salad. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how this is a nice little tool I purchased to cut your avocado. And it has like a smooth, serrated, non-harming, non-cutting to your skin blade, but it will take care of your avocado. And this is to remove your pit. And it also can slice your avocado if you like. We're gonna actually manually cut it into cubes once we do this.
And this is what your pit looks like. It came out right here. So now we're going to just slice our avocado. Hold on, this knife not behaving itself. <laughs> it's just easier to peel this way if you cut it into a little half. Mm -hmm. It just makes it easier to peel back your avocado this way. This, I'm just gonna cut it into little cubes. You are going, ah, here's a trick. I'm gonna give you a tip of a lifetime if you don't know this already. When you're dealing with your avocados, because we know the avocado, and which is by the way, an avocado is really considered a fruit, but we use it as part of our all of our savory dishes and some baking, some you know sweet things as well. But technically, it is a fruit, such as tomatoes. Technically, is considered a fruit. Really? But I know for us, we use it in everything savory. So just keep it the same. We won't talk anymore. So here's the tip. When you have your avocado, to prevent it from oxidizing, which happens all the time once you cut it, right? Same thing with like, this trip won't work for apples, but it definitely worked for your avocado. You wanna have the actual seed in a bowl of water and have it next to your avocado. When you're making guac, when you're making anything that's avocado related, have your seed in a bowl of water next wow. to the avocado it, it will not oxidize hmm. it will remain green and vibrant you'll thank me later well okay Eek, so you can turn around and you can put everything in your salad bowl okay i chop these up for you all right oh that's so beautiful in that i'm gonna put the parmesan in. all right Eek. okay Woohoo! Parmesan, here we go. Yes. Parmesan, here we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, yes, I love cheese. Mm -hmm. But we all know who I, what I love the most. You love your bacon, Mom. Yes, I do bacon, love mom. my bacon. And this is not a bacon salad, I know, but mm -hmm. bacon goes with everything, though. It doesn't matter. Okay. okay, so now you want to mix everything yes, all I together. Yes, I do. I'm going to slide that over a little bit, Mom, and, if you don't mind. Okay. Sure. Okay. So I'm gonna and I guess I will do the salad for yeah. you. That'd be nice. Okay. So what we have here is some olive oil. We have three tablespoons of white wine. Not white wine vinegar, just white wine. Mm-hmm. We're going to use Oop. a little bit of our Himalayan salt. Yes. Here we go. And you want to put a little salt on that too, Ian. Mm -hmm. huh? mm -hmm. A little black pepper. Mm-hmm. Wow. Here we go. Oh, that's looking nice. Yeah, let's, let's add a little flavor. Go a right little ahead. flavor to your life. Mm -hmm. Let's wow. move that a little closer. There you go. Get some flavor here to your life, E. Because mm -hmm. someone told me you needed some flavor. Yes, I said, I oh, E. They said, yeah, E. I said, okay. Let's give E the flavor, flavor he needs. Sure. Here you go. A little sprinkle salts and some peps. And get some a lemon. Oh, yes. A quarter please, of a lemon we're going to squeeze the, in here. Yeah, please hit the. Okay. Squeeze a quarter of a lemon in here. And the reason I'm using gloves, Mama? It is because it's RTE. Thank you. And RTE means what, E? Ready to eat. And I'm always that. You know that, Mama. And so I am my own boo thing. I'm going to take my gloves off soon <laughs> so I can have... Mm-hmm. My food. Yeah. Okay. And so here we have some fine chopped dill. And dill really goes great with fish. Particularly salmon. Okay, so can I get a whiskey? Yes, you can have a whiskey right here, Mom. All right. This is all said and done. Oh, look at that. So we're gonna whisk this up. Yes. You're gonna pour that over your salad and mix it one more time and then we're going to put our garnish. Our garnish is the rest of the salmon, the plantain croupon, and a little bit of parsley. Okay. And a little drizzle of, actually we're going to put it right here. Honey. We have a little bit of honey in our packet here. Here we go. 
who does just to kind of like tone down the acid just a little bit. And who doesn't love honey? honey exactly. Who doesn't love a little sweetness in their life? Ian, our salad is already garnished with the extra salmon we had and the plantain croutons yes. and our parsley. And look how gorgeous! Unbelievably looking delicious. I'm ready. I'm hungry. All right, because I'm hungry too. Yes. Haven't eaten all day, so mm -hmm. this is a nice meal mm -hmm. with all the healthy stuff. So, of course, because Ian, you're my buddy, I'm going to serve you first. Thank you. And, uh, Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> That's beautiful. I know you want to get some salmon up in yeah. here. I know you love some salmon, salmon uh, Ian. I'm a salmon. I'm a salmon so fish. you're a salmon man. That's right. Anyone yes. who knows me out there knows me that I love water. Almost as much as I love bacon. And what do we have today, Mama? What and you, you know, guys, you know, <laughs> I can't go a day without bacon. bacon. So I got my bacon! <laughs> I got my bacon! Humble. And I'm going to put my bacon, mm. and I have a big bowl of bacon too, so I could just like chew as like chips, you know, throughout. Mm -hmm. I love bacon, yes. I know you probably like, geez, you already have stuff on there. Yeah, I know, but I didn't have bacon. So now it's complete. I got bacon. Bacon on everything. And don't be upset with me. I did ask Ian if he wanted some turkey bacon. And I was going to make some for him. And he said, no, Mama, I don't want any. Not so today. I did offer. <laughs> yes, she did. And But I had my real bacon. <laughs> and I am so happy. So, Ian, what time is it? Bon Bon appetit. <laughs> Okay, so let me try to get everything in here, including my bacon, mm -hmm. <laughs> my salmon, my cucumbers, my avocado. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, my avocado. Oh, my avocado. Oh, some and chips. Oh, my salmon fell off. Mm -hmm. My cucumber. Don't do that to me, okay? Right, I think I got everything. Oh, yep. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait a minute. I didn't get my bacon. Ha ha. Mm. <laughs> wow. Mm. Okay, I just think the bacon makes everything better. But this salad is totally divine. Without the bacon. Mm -hmm. With the bacon? Delish. So good. good. It's got so many different flavors at one time. I am loving every bite of this. Mm -hmm. Definitely loving the bite. Mm. Again. There is a vegetable in here that you don't like, like maybe onions, omit it. If you don't like salmon, you like another fish, add it. Wow. Oh, if you... you don't eat fish at all, mm. remove it. Make this your own. Unbelievably Okay, now delicious. you make one taste. Please taste it. Now that is refreshing. What a flavorful taste with all those in it. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh my gosh. You taste the ginger, but mm -hmm. nothing like fiery yeah, you know, peppery, just a nuts. slight in the ginger. With the sweetness. It mm. actually tastes so invigorating. Mm. Mm. My kind of water, and I'm a, I'm a big water drinker. I go to sleep with a gallon of water next to my bed. Um, literally, I'm drinking water throughout the middle of the night. You know, I just, I'm a fanatic of water. So now you guys know a little bit about me. I'm a fanatic of bacon. I'm a fanatic of water. I'm a fanatic of herbe de Provence mm -hmm. and cinnamon. Those are really four of my key things that I really like. And avocado. Five. Shh. But yes, mm. water, if you can, definitely, it's unsweetened tea that we got. Um, it was a lemon ginger bliss. And I just added some fresh, lemon slices and a few fresh strawberry slices and it's good to go Absolutely. you can have a part of that and you don't have to have any sugar and it's so tasty very healthy and the salad oh i cannot wait mm. our friends are coming over Ian and i and 
they're gonna eat the rest of the salad with us. Yeah, so and yeah. that crunch from the plantain chip is everything. Oh, delish. Mm. Please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe and be part of our family. Right, Mom? Absolutely, Ian. Right. Absolutely. Give us a hug. You definitely Virtually give us a hug. by clicking the like button. We'll speak to you soon. Love you. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.